Recently, I went to a psychic. I did a project about Civil War reenactors in the American South. So she described an image that I had made of a man, a Union soldier, wearing head to toe blue with a lot of brass and a mustache. I really thought that she knew about this image only through her psychic abilities. I thought when she said that, I was like, she's for real. And then I look back on the footage because I'm editing it for a piece and it's pretty clear that she Googled me. I've been a photographer since I was a little girl, and as an only child, I would entertain myself with my Kodak disc camera, photographing my dolls and Care Bears, and would always take all of the household lamps and position them in my room to make a fake portrait studio. I had always wanted to be working as a photographer, and that happened for me when I moved to LA, and that was pretty lucky and a lot of things kind of coalesced to make that happen. I knew that I wanted to focus on my own work. I knew that I wanted to create my own projects and having just finished my first year at the School of Visual Arts in the MFA program for photography, video and related media, I can say that I am in the best program that I could possibly be in for my work. My peers are extremely talented and rigorous and hard-working people and I feel supported and challenged at the same time which is what I was looking for in grad school. You know, I think it's exciting to be able to get up on a random day and start walking around the city and have that take you into so many different worlds. The project that I'm doing for Illy is fun and it incorporates the city and people and their gestures. I always get really frustrated by the stereotypes because I feel like New Yorkers are pretty open people and pretty friendly and helpful and you know the stereo I think people I think New Yorkers get a get a bad rap. I've moved a lot as an adult. I moved um, I moved to Ohio, I moved to San Francisco, I moved to New York City, then I moved to Los Angeles and then I moved back to New York City. And I think what I've always been looking for is a different experience when I wake up. Um, because I'm a visual person, I want to see something different every day.